since 2010, under the Conservatives, we've seen arrests halved, prosecutions halved, convictions halved, community penalties halved, court delays at record highs, and record numbers of victims giving up on the criminal justice system and dropping out. And the prosecution rate has plummeted by a shocking two-thirds since 2015, with only one in 20 recorded crimes now charged. So quite literally, that means more criminals are getting away with it after 13 years of Conservative government. And the Home Secretary is doing nothing to turn that around. Then that collapse in prosecution started in 2015. Successive Home Secretaries have just shrugged their shoulders and failed to act. On policing, the Home Secretary is absent too. Across the country, I have met dedicated and brave police officers who are doing a brilliant job to keep people safe. Neighbourhood officers and PCSIOs I spoke to yesterday in Milton Keynes, who are working incredibly hard to tackle knife crime, which has risen sharply in the area. Response officers that I've spoken to in Yorkshire, who risk their own lives to stop a dangerous machete attacker or the detectives in Merseyside I spoke to, working night and day to solve and investigate homicide and organised crime. But for all that dedication and hard work, public confidence in policing has fallen, and according to some surveys, by 20% in just two years.